Hi, my name's Naomi. I work at OA Centers for Orthopedics in Portland. I want to show you how to put on the anti-rotational boots that patients wear after a hip procedure. This will come um, with the two boots. They do come separate. I would recommend that you put the boots on first, and then I'll show you how to put the foam drum in the middle. Pop that there. OK. So the boots have a red logo, and that should go on the outside of the lower leg. Now, if you lift up your leg, Kate, and put your heel right down in there, piece of foam, tuck it around, secure the ankle part first, then the forefoot, and then snug on the top part. We'll do the same on the other side. And have you get your foot right in there, secure the ankle part first, the forefoot, and then the top part. And again, the red logo is on the outside of each lower leg. You would then take the drum, and you're going to put Velcro from uh, one side to the forefoot, calf to the forefoot, making a big X with the Velcro. So I'm going to position this in between and start the process. And you try to pull the feet in to make them pigeon-toed, because you do not want the foot to fall out. Pull that right in. And pull that right in. And you'll be wearing either the boots or the hip brace for the next two weeks. And that's how you put on the anti-rotational boots. <laughs>